Welcome to my sneaker closet. My name is Josh Liver. I am the CEO and co-founder of StockX. And uh, you're standing in my sneaker closet, which is about the size of my apartment when I lived in New York City. So, so here's the thing. So my um, three favorite silhouettes um, are the Air Jordan 1, uh, Air Tech Challenge 2, and the Air Max BW. Um, I built seven pairs of the Air Max BW Persian, and so um, certainly one of my grails, and I literally was just able to buy it, like unapologetic plug, shout out to StockX, um, which was to get the Air Max BW stash, um, which had been a shoe that I'd wanted forever, um, and I literally had a bid sitting out of my size for a price that I didn't think anyone would take. Um, and was uh, super fortunate to get it. You can actually see how the air bubble is like completely yellowed over um, and will probably pop if I wore these too much. So this was a grail that I'd wanted forever, the Air Max BW stash, um, and finally got that one. Um, you know, I guess, I guess I'm supposed to say that this is a grail. Um, this was, Nike ID had just become a thing or just become somewhat um, more prolific. And these were shoes that my brother made for me for my wedding. Um, and this color palette I thought was amazing. I thought he did a great job, but it's got my wedding date in here back when it was still pretty uh, crazy and cool that you could print on your own shoes. Um, 3-17-07 was, was my wedding date. So I, I think for, for no other reason than to make uh, my wife not mad at me, uh, these are a great one. Um, the most underrated shoe, um, here I will pull this, I will bring this back over here for you, um, is absolutely these, um, which is, uh, collaboration between Adidas and the designer Pucci um, and I bought these on a trip to Hong Kong in 2006 back when uh, that's what you did when you traveled you went to every sneaker store and every place you, to find sneakers because uh, it wasn't quite as um, prolific globally that you could buy every shoe uh, from your computer um, and I have a second pair of these that I've never worn um, but these shoes go really well with a tuxedo um, and, uh, and a green and a bright green tie, which I didn't realize that green would become such a prominent part of, of my business. But um, Pucci collabs with Adidas, definitely up there, super underrated. I wear these, nobody's seen them, nobody has them, nobody knows what they are. And like, that's kind of the fun part. Depending on how well you know me, maybe you would, maybe you wouldn't uh, expect these. Um, this is a Buscemi slide, um, Andy Social Social Club, uh, Buscemi slide. Uh, obviously, it's bright fuchsia. Um, the leather on these are unbelievable and so soft, and uh, I think people at the office find it quite uh, either ridiculous or amusing when I wear these to the office uh, in the summertime. So, um, yeah, bright fuchsia slides. Shout out John Buscemi. Thank you very much. This is the first pair of Jordans uh, that I ever uh, bought, um, which is Concord from uh, 2000. And in the beginning of 2000, after I had my first paycheck, I literally went to the store at the mall and this was probably two, three months after the shoe came out, right? So the fact that this was still sitting there and I walked in and there was a pair on the wall and I was like, that, I want those. And there were two guys working at the, the sneaker store. It was like a foot action in the mall. And, uh, and they looked at each other and they look at me and they look at each other and they look at me. And I was like, what? And, and they were like, well, there was like, there's one pair left of, you know, of 10 and a half your size. And, uh, and you know, we were gonna sell it on eBay. And I was like, no, 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 no. I was like, you're absolutely not selling that eBay. It's like, I'm buying that. And somehow I got out of the store with it. And then I wore them to play basketball for the next probably 18 months and just absolutely beat them. And they, they still look like that. You can see the leather uh, beat. And um, not that Jordans make you play better, but I did have my greatest game ever. I had 51 uh, wearing these, so I, I feel like that's probably direct correlation. So these are my first Jordans, definitely the best cop. You know, obviously I'm unbelievably biased, but um, the way that I use StockX is by far the most powerful, which is both of these shoes I've wanted for years. I didn't really want to pay, you know, full market or, or what people were asking for it. And I had a bid out there. I had a bid sitting out there for a really long time. And then one day I get a notification that, you know, the shoes are yours, that somebody accepted your bid. And so most of the future cops I have are, are stuff like that, that, you know, they're older shoes that have been sitting out there, always extra SB Dunks, um, you know, always, um, the rest of the rest of this pack, the first uh, AirTech Challenge to Wimbledon, um, stuff like that. There's more than enough room in this closet for all the future cops that uh, that come my way. <laughs>